Hey, paisanos, it's the Super Mario Brothers Super Show! Captain N, the Game Master. playing Super Mario Brothers for the Nintendo Entertainment System. Uh, oh man, I mean, there's really not, <laughs> there's not much of an intro that I can do for this game that you probably already don't know. This is the game that started it all. The entire uh, modern video game industry stems from this game. And this is not, I mean, this is not an original Actually, this is Nintendo 1980. This may be an original U.S. release, uh, Super Mario Brothers cartridge. Um, it's a it's a it's a co Super Mario Brothers slash Duck Hunt, which obviously you saw when you looked at the front. But it does say uh, Nintendo 1985 right here on the back. So 1985. So anyway, um, let's play. Okay, here we are. We're going to be playing Super Mario Brothers. This is the game that started it all. The Nintendo craze, I mean, video games in general, uh, were pretty much saved by the little plumber. Now, I believe he was... The name Mario comes from the... The, the company Nintendo, their headquarters is in Seattle, and they had a, a landlord who was an Italian... And apparently he had a really bad temper, and that they, they uh, that's who Mario is based off of, and I, I believe that's why he was originally a, a villain in uh, in Donkey Kong. And of course he was originally called Jumpman, not Mario. That came later. Um, but fun little fact about Super Mario. I could play this, uh, play out all my lives and, and honestly try to beat the game, but I think that that could take a long time. So what we're going to do is we're just going to see how far I can make it on a single life in this video. But I mean, if your nostalgia is not pumping right now, uh, your nostalgia mu muscle. And the coins are important. You know, a lot of people... I don't, I don't get down with points unless I get three lives from them, but in, uh, in Super Mario Brothers, the coins really will save your ass. And uh, I'm going to do this as cheaply as possible. <laughs> now let's see how far I can get. Alright, try this again. There we go. Alright, that's right. Cheap the whole level. All right, and here we are at the first warp zone. We're going to take this to uh, level 4-1, and then we're going to jump over to 4-2, and in 4-2 there is a warp zone, which will take us to uh, level 8, which is, of course, the last level in the game. Thing, another thing to mention is, is I'm playing this on an original Nintendo. This is an original cartridge. Actually, the last time I played this game, it crashed. So there's a, always a fun possibility that that could happen, although it looks pretty good. Um, but the thing is, is 
a lot of the difficulty that came from playing the original Nintendo was using the controller. So if you're watching Let's Play videos, and these guys are these guys are using um, emulators in order to avoid the game crashing and in order to uh, avoid you know using an original controller. The fact is that they're not playing with the difficulty that that was the original. Because let me tell you. Um, it's not a very responsive control. I mean, it's, it's really durable. They, they, they're still around, but... Um, well, 2,000 points is fine. <laughs> I'll take that. And what... <laughs> it's about what we got. We didn't do so high. But it doesn't matter. It's actually easier to do when you're small. But there we go. No, 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 no. We gotta go. There we go. And up we go. And this little section of the Mushroom Kingdom will lead us to um, level 8. Now this is when things get legit. This is actually a really difficult level. I'm not gonna lie to you. <laughs> Chances of me beating this on my first go are not great. There are a series of significantly difficult jumps, especially towards the end of the level. And uh, if you play reckless, I'm not gonna get the free life, whatever. Let's try to, let's try to play safe. Also, the other thing is, is when you get towards the end of the, if, if you're if you're moving slowly, if you're moving cautiously at the end, when the music speeds up, I mean that really <laughs> like puts the pressure on you. You, just, you think, oh my gosh, you know, you put you put all this time into making it through the level, and then they're gonna just you know sort of cheap you like that. Um, that's pressure in all different directions, making uh, short-term and long-term decisions based on information very quickly. Oh! Alright, well anyway, I told you. Uh, very difficult, and um, anyway, that's uh, that's my my one play, my one life, one play on Super Mario Brothers, and uh, thanks for watching.